The uh, assignment uh, was to uh, develop the organization and uh, also improve profitability. Uh, any thoughts on, on the starting point? Yes. So first things that needed to be done is of course, you know, you have to get the organization in place and, 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 and do the right structure. You have to design it. And, and here we did the, uh, uh, an organizational change so that we went from regional to business area uh, oriented. There already is a big change for everybody. Then the second one was to get the profit up. And these, these two things needed to happen in parallel at the same time with a very short uh, timeline. What were the steps you took uh, with the organization and also in concrete terms how did you get the prices up in this case? Yeah. We take the organization at first because this is important when you come into a new organization because you need to be on board for the day one you cannot have an onboarding slowly up you need to start from the day one and this is to get to know the people uh, to interview them because my experience from past is it's not there are in in a, in a problem in an organization that has challenges or problems. It's not about the individuals. Usually about how they work as a team. How how, how do you go from then to the next uh, step there in, uh, towards the concrete negotiation phase yeah. together with clients? What was your role? What was the role of your team members? Yeah. A very good question because first of when we noticed how bad it was. And to set a target, that was quite astronomic target that we needed to set there. So we needed to come up to an all-time high price increase for all customers, with contract, not contract. And many of the customers had contract, long contract that could have said no to this. So, so it was a lot of this, it's not possible, we cannot do it. So here I, I needed to take not only a leader, a leading position, but also a totally frontline position here to help them, to support them by being there and also taking me, participating personally in those tougher negotiations. The results were very good, so I think you, 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 did, yeah. you, you did something right, that's for sure. Uh, going forward now, the uh, pro uh, project, the assignment is wrapping up. Uh, what makes you particularly proud of this assignment and the team therein? The, as you said, the great result. I mean, we have all time high prices now. So the impossible, it's done. For one thing. And the organization, they are now working as a team. From being reactive, now they're working proactively. This can be seen. Especially now I'm coming towards the last weeks of my assignment. There are not the same questions and, and, and details coming up and asking asking me anymore they are taking decisions so persistence has paid off they are uh, let's say decision making is happening close to the customers today any last comments that you would have to uh, other interim managers or people who are looking towards interim management yeah. <clears throat> you have to you have to think yourself as a part of the team not that you're an external consultant in this you are the team there even if you know that this will be a short term, six, seven months, whatever it takes. And uh, focus on the task and, get, and be part of the team and work with the team. And you will, you will know see results quite rapidly. Very good. Thank you, Mika. Great discussion uh, today and all the best. Thank you very much, Nicholas.